New at 10, a fight over Festus chimpanzees should be over, except for new revelations that came out in court today. Fox Files investigator Chris Hayes was there when a Missouri woman was accused of lying that a chimpanzee died so she can secretly keep it. Tanya Haddix often sobbed in court so passionately that the judge often had to take breaks as Haddix broke down. Here's Haddix in April 2021 when she was caring for the seven chimpanzees she had at the time. She gave Fox 2 exclusive access to the property, Connie Casey's place in Festus. Haddix moved on to the property to help the aging Casey. At the same time, the animal rights group PETA was alleging unsafe and unsanitary conditions. That led to a court order for the chimps to be moved to an accredited Florida sanctuary. Haddix fought back in June. They're not getting the chimps. They're not getting. Then in July, PETA seized the chimps with U.S. Marshal oversight. But one chimp was missing. Haddix claimed it died. But in court today, a PETA lawyer told a judge, quote, Haddix refused to cooperate and provide evidence to support her assertion. It's part of a scheme to prevent transfer. PETA lawyer Jerry Goodman said Haddix claimed she burned the chimp's body and that only ashes were left. A forensic anthropologist testified today it would be impossible and that bones would remain. Haddix often cried. She described how she found the chimp dead, whose name is Tonka, and added, quote, I can't provide him to you guys if he died. And my whole thing is, I know I talk big because I wanted those chimps. But the fact is, I did not stand in the way of the court order when you guys took them. After nearly four hours in court, the judge ruled Haddix is not in contempt of court. Judge Catherine Perry said Haddix, quote, makes things up and also offered implausible evidence. But she said it's not enough to prove the chimp is alive. She said she will listen to new evidence as it arises. For the Fox Files, I'm Chris Hayes.